Welcome back guys. So today in this lecture I am going to talk to you how to deploy your node app. So for the deployment we are going to use two cloud platforms. First one is Heroku itself and second one is MLab. So the first step you have to perform is to register yourself in Heroku and MLab and log in. So pause the video and create account and log in and come back for further steps. Okay. So now I am expecting you are successfully registered and logged in. After you logged in, you have the pay this page in front of you. Okay, so now here click on node.js get started as we have to deploy our node app and then it will open a new tab with documentation. Okay, so wait for it. Now click on I am ready to start and for the deployment of app you have to download CLI that is command line interface for your machine. So now from the drop down select your OS and download a CLI and install it. I already have Heroku CLI on my machine. Ok so now when you have CLI installed on your machine we are ready to create our app on Heroku. So for creating our app on Heroku you have to open your CMD type Heroku Heroku and then enter your Heroku credentials. Okay. After logged in with CLI in Heroku, open your project directory in your text editor. So here is my project directory and I am using sublime text tree. And then create a new file named as proc file in your project directory. And inside of your file type web colon node and your application file that is app.js in my case and save it. Okay, so now to create app on Heroku through command line type Heroku create and the app name. So it should be demo app by RPS. Okay. So now what we have what you have to do is to open your Heroku dashboard and refresh the page. And now you can see your app. Okay there and click on it. And after that click and after that click on the deploy here and open the CMD again and navigate it to your project directory so it is on my desktop with the name authentication no with the name of demo clear the screen and then so then what we have to do first of all we have to initialize and get repository over here so get in it then after doing this what we have to do we have to set up Heroku as a remote repository for this project so we have to type uh, this command in our command prompt so Heroku get remote like a and then demo app by and hit enter okay and then in last uh, we have our app created on Heroku and set up our deposit remote repository 
uh, for our project in uh, and we also set up the project repository uh, remote repository on Heroku so now we are ready to post all the files on Heroku so for posting the files we have the command git post Heroku master okay okay so it's saying that error src master does not match any okay so let's check the branch so we don't have any branch right now so let's do something to create it so get add so get commit that's m so we are going to commit all the changes now if we check for a branch so we have a master branch now we are ready to push the changes to the Heroku so hit enter so now what happened here is now deploying our app on Heroku server okay okay so build succeeded uh, okay so but we forget something we forget to set up our DB on MLab so for that you have to open uh, so you have to open the MLab and then create click here on a create new so you will create new database from here and after that here on the single node then sandbox which provide you 500 MB free storage and then the database name is demo and then create new mongodb deployment okay after doing this uh, what you have to do uh, is this, the database name demo is currently not available okay so demo we could type demo app by so let's do it again press the page and then on a single node sandbox and the database name demo app by RCs okay then create new mongodb deployment let's see if it's work or not okay so we have our database setup now click on it now what you have to do is to create a user for your database so we are going to create a user by clicking on this user tab and then add database user button and the username is admin and the password is just one two three four five six okay then create and after you did this the only thing you have to do is to copy this line of code and then open a text editor in the app.js here in the mongoose.connection you have to give that link instead of localhost and then db in place of db user your username so it is admin and the password that is 123456 okay 123456 so save it open your cmd again add the changes make a commit type ready for deployment with mongo hit enter and then push the changes back to the Heroku okay so now it will push all the changes we have done back to the Heroku and then our project will be built successfully and we are ready to uh, using our project live on a server okay so it's verifying deploy okay so it's done so now in order to open your app you can do two things you can open your app by two methods first of all you can click here on the open app and second one is to use the command line and type Heroku and then open and hit enter okay so here our app is working live on a web now let's see if the database is working or not 
so here in user management I'm going to sign up for our account and I will type test okay then my password and then click on sign up okay so I'm logged in so now refresh this MLab account go back to collections and as you can see we have here a document called users and inside of it we have our <coughs> data okay so here is the email through which I am registered and the hash password okay so this is the way you can deploy a node app so here we have database working we have our app running on the live on the server so if you like it give a big thumbs up and do subscribe thank you